Since the election of President Trump, both sides of the immigration debate are making moves. That includes institutions like churches and schools. Just outside the Beltway, the University of Maryland is creating a job solely to help illegal immigrants, called undocumented student coordinator. I think it does create a false stigma when we say undocumented students or illegal immigrants or anything like that, because a lot of them are here for education. I think it'll really like um, make their transition into college a lot easier. Right now, there are more than 100 undocumented students attending class right here on the UMD campus. Many are protected under an Obama administration policy known as the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, or DACA. It allows undocumented immigrants who enter the country as minors a two-year period of deferred action from deportation. Alfonso Aguilar, the former chief of the U.S. Office of Citizenship, told CBN News this move by UMD is meant to advance the political agenda on campus and even clash with President Trump's immigration policy. Donald Trump has been very clear that he's going to go after undocumented immigrants who pose a threat uh, to the security of our communities, people with serious criminal records. Um, so they're not going after DACA recipients. So you feel this move by Maryland is strictly political? Sadly, it is. I think they're trying to make a political point. Uh, there were more deportations under Obama. Why didn't they create this uh, office under Obama? We reached out to the University of Maryland for that answer, and they gave us this statement. As part of the university's ongoing commitment to undocumented students, we continue to consider ways to offer support. We are assigning a UMD staff person to serve as a coordinator to address the immediate needs of the undocumented student population, and we will continue to assess the need for staff support moving forward. I've gotten various emails from the university saying that this is a place, this is a sanctuary for all kinds of students, whether uh, no matter where they're from. Which at the end really uh, exacerbates the fear among uh, DACA recipients because it sounds like they're creating the office to protect them because the federal government is coming after them, which is not happening. Ben Kennedy, CBN News, Maryland.